Okay, today I'm going to do an unboxing video on a ceiling net for my 4Runner. Um, I recently received a commission bonus as well as my tax return. Looking at some different things I wanted to do to the 4Runner. Um, a lot of them were more for fun rather than function, some off-road lights. Um, that was probably one of the big ones I wanted to do. Uh, you know, a lot, of, a lot of fun stuff, but really stuff wouldn't get utilized on a day-to-day -day basis. And then I, I came across uh, these ceiling nets. And uh, I was like, oh, me and my wife could make that and, and hang that in the roof of the ceiling of, of our Forerunner. And you would put our kids' coats up there or, you know, cool stuff like that. Um, we do have a dog and he sheds a lot. And so it's nice to get those items, uh, sweaters, clothes, uh, diaper bag up off the floor. And we usually use a tote in the back. Uh, but this will allow us to kind of not only get rid of that, get it out of his way, get it out of his hair on a day-to-day -day basis, but when we go on longer trips and vacations when he's not with us and the, the vehicle's packed to the brim, we'll be able to put things up top there and uh, keep it out of the way. Uh, you know, I, I've been in off-road a long time and I enjoy taking my vehicle expedition type camping trips and uh, stuff like that. Uh, I've never really seen these before and when I first saw it, I was like, that's sweet. And then, after doing some more research and looking at people's different options, I realized that some of the people out there had, uh, had purchased theirs. So I went on this company's website um, Wrangler.com, I believe, um, and and looked at these, and they um, so for this one, it's 130 bucks, and uh, shipping was like six or seven bucks. So I think I paid total like 136, 53 or something like that. Um, but let's go ahead and open this up and take a look at it. Got a little pamphlet, and that's spelt um, R A I N G L E R. Little pamphlet that comes with it. Uh, shipping order confirmation. And then here's the the net. Got a little rubber band on it. This is 21 inches by 36 inches, and this is one inch uh, webbing. And I went with uh, black on black. Uh, this is their uh, basic uh, grade webbing. They do have a couple of step ups. Um, me and my wife really liked the one that had the netting with the mesh in it, but with having a pet, uh, we did worry that we'd have uh, dog hair get caught in there. So we chose against that. But I really think this will be perfect. She mentioned uh, we could put a blanket up in there on the underside of it and then with uh, coats or whatever on top um, and I really like that idea because we generally like to have a blanket in the vehicle anyways and I really like their uh, their logo on here it's red stitching it really looks nice uh, one thing I really liked in the purchasing process uh, their website was very easy to navigate um, and one thing I didn't really expect was right after I ordered it, uh, generally companies send an email letting you know um, what your UPS code is, and or, or or simply just saying thanks for shopping with us, and then a few days later when they send it, they send you a UPS code. When they sent uh, me the email afterwards confirming my order, uh, they indicated that uh, it would take between one and 21 days to um, basically manufacture the unit uh, before sending it. Um, I was pleasantly surprised the very next day they ended up sending a shipping code and sent it uh, uh, to me. Um, I wouldn't expect that to be normal and like I said I was very shocked by that uh, quick response time on this. Um, another thing that I was pleasantly surprised with was their website. Um, you clicked on the link for the tracking code and it took you to their website and it showed you a map and really just a clean website in that way. Uh, most companies just send you directly to UPS or USPS uh, for your shipping code and USPS will show you where everything's at, but they track it directly on their website, which I thought was pretty cool. And like I said, it was, you know, some companies that may try to do that, it doesn't come out very clean. And theirs uh, was very, very clean, more so than uh, USPS or UPS. So I got a few different update emails. The first one was, uh, uh, your item's been shipped, and then uh, that was on a Saturday, and then on uh, the following 
Tuesday it said it was out for delivery and then another follow-up email to say that it has been delivered. And I, I appreciate that follow-up and, and knowing it, you know, I work, I'm not at home all the time. So having that notification that that's there is always nice. So uh, look forward to a future video where uh, we're going to install this in our, our Forerunner. Uh, looking forward to that. I'm really excited to get to use this. Uh, we're going to Moab uh, in a couple weeks and really excited to be able to use this and, and try it out on one of those long trips. So with the hardware, uh, it came with this uh, business card. Uh, it says install helpline. Uh, please go to wranglerinstall.com for tips and images on, on how to install. And it also has a, a call line, so you can actually call a 1-800 number uh, for help on install. That's pretty cool that they actually want to help you get their product installed and that they're willing to give you a, a number to call and, and they can just take you through the process of doing that. Um, again, like the uh, LCE engineering um, kit, this did not come with an installation manual, but it uh, obviously does have some online. So it looks like that's what a lot of people are doing with their products is putting their install kits uh, and PDFs online for use there.